you guys create a lot of chances out there. Kind of sounds like there's a little frustration offensively with that puck not going in. How do you handle that? And, and how do you still keep a level head? Uh, you know, when you have games like this where you're beating the goaltender but not the posts. Yeah, we just gotta stay positive. I think the fact that we're getting those chances is big for us. We just gotta work on bearing down and finishing those, and uh, it will come. Is this a situation where, where the veterans really need to? St you guys are getting some scoring and offense from from that freshman class, which is nice. But the veterans, do you feel you guys need to step up a little more and, and maybe you know help get this team out of the offensive funk? Yeah, definitely. I think uh, me especially and all the girls, seniors, juniors, and sophomores, all their turns on the team really have to step up. I think we've been uh, we've been good at times, but I don't think we played our best. So we got to take it upon ourselves to really help this team out and bring in the next level. Is there something on the team that you've seen like in the last week that is really starting to improve and heading in the right direction? Yeah, I could. I say uh, we're really starting to focus on detail more. We're getting those uh, little things worked out in practice, and it showed in these last few games. Even though it didn't come up on the scoreboard, it, uh, we could see it in the locker room, and all the girls know that we're heading in the right direction. Two here, Com maybe compared to yesterday. I think if uh, if we were tracking puck possession like the men do, I wonder what the minutes would. I think we had the puck for quite uh, quite a bit today as well as yesterday. Um, but puck possession doesn't get you wins. Mm -hmm. So I think we hit seven pipes. Uh, they gave you four officially. Unless you count that time Brogy one broke shot hit the pipe twice. <laughs> well, I know she hit two pipes in two different instances. We had yeah. a couple in the first. Whatever it is, I mean, you got to bury those. Those come back to haunt you. Um, it's tough to win games when you only score one. Um, but yeah, I, I think both games we played pretty well, pretty consistently. The third, I would have liked to go a little bit better. Uh, I would have liked our four check to be a little, a little more determined starting that period. Um, but overall, I think we're getting better every single time we step on the ice, and uh, players are learning, getting good looks. We're playing good teams. We're playing good goalies. Um, I think early adversity, as I mentioned last weekend, pays dividends um, in February and March. Do you sense any offensive frustration from your team at all? Because they are getting chances if the puck's just not going in. Yeah, I would say so, sure. Yeah, we're getting, I don't know what the overall shots were combined. We have 27 tonight, 35 last night. Yeah, something like that. And two goals, so yeah. yeah. The, how do you handle that frustration? Uh, how do you keep them from, from letting that frustration get to them? Try to give them some tactics to take better shots or think about certain things. But, you know, I think if you're getting opportunities and you're getting good looks and goalies are making good saves, it's all part of the game. So you have to stick with it. I think we've done a really good job of being resilient. Um, and so I think it, it's just a matter of time. It just takes a little longer sometimes. You like what you've seen out of Naomi Rogi early on here? I, I thought re she didn't put the puck in the net, but it seems like she's creating a lot of chances and, and moving well with the puck out there. Yeah, absolutely. Um, she's she's playing on a nice line, um, has earned that spot, and I think she's a, she can be a good goal scorer for us, um, and she's exciting when she has the puck. She makes a lot of plays, so she's doing well. Could have done without the penalty in the last two minutes, but it is what it is. You mentioned getting better every week. What what specifically did you see that was an improvement over what you did in Columbus? I think our speed was there uh, consistently. Our forecheck was good. Our D were mobile, um, very active. Our neutral zone play was quick. So quick transitions, I think we had them under a lot of pressure throughout the whole game. 